Julia. And what do you do for a living? I have a pet import company. What's a day in the life look like running a pet import company? It's actually pretty stressful, um, mm -hmm. but I have a lot of free time. I'm doing sports, just enjoying my life. So what do you do for the business? Like um, I have a people who work in, who like doing all the job. I'm just like manage them and make sure everything works proper. So you're just delegating tasks? I. In a time, yeah. With yeah. the time, yeah, I delegate everything. Okay, I see. But and it started from like all me, you know. When did you start this business? Um, three and a half years ago. Okay. And what made you start it? Um, the prices for dog. When I was about to buy my first dog, mm. I just saw the prices and I'm like, okay, we can do something about it. I see. Speaking of prices, how much do you make? So the, it's a different. Like a, each each pet is different. Depends yeah. from breed, color, and other stuff. Yeah. About 5k per one. So like how much per year? Oh, <laughs> I, was, I was thinking you were asking about uh, the pet. No, no, no. I, so like, how, much, how much is your business making per year? About 300,000. What qualities do you think someone needs to have to do well in the pet space or just to have a business? Just be unique, follow your curiosity and just not, don't listen to anyone except your intuition. This is only one rule and keep working. That's it. Just listen to yourself and yeah, work hard. And don't don't listen to anyone else because like the people just know what is good for them, yeah. not for you. You are you are know everything. Just like truly listen to yourself. Your intuition will tell you everything. No, I like that. I agree with that. My last question is: What's your favorite thing about running a pet business? My favorite thing is just to be free and make my own decision. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. That's all the questions for me. Yes. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate it.